Veterans Voices on News Channel 34 is sponsored by Avery Auto Service, BAE Systems, and UHS. Tonight's Veterans Voices presents military camaraderie of another kind. It's a sense of community found back in hometowns throughout the U.S. News Channel 34's Amy Simpson has the story. This group of women didn't sign up to serve their country, but their sons and daughters did. You come together here and we listen to each other and we get it. And it's just that understanding that isn't often provided out in the real world. This is just one of more than 200 chapters of the Blue Star Mothers of America. Here in Virginia's capital city, they call themselves the Blue Star Families of Richmond. Stephanie Sill says it's a sisterhood. My oldest son, Joshua, um, is actually a veteran now of the Army. He served about eight years. Her son's deployment made her appreciate other moms who can relate. He plays with bombs for a living, so pretty much every day was a stressful day for me. The group gets together all year long, packing treats for troops, each December decorating a holiday tree at the Virginia War Memorial. Susan Holcher is one of the newest members of the group. I joined the group and immediately they sent a care package to my daughter. Right now, her daughter is deployed in the Middle East. Every day you say a prayer that she's going to be safe and everybody that she's serving with is going to be safe. These moms say they're filled with emotions while supporting their sons and daughters, worried during deployments, but pride to have a child in uniform. My kid went and joined the military. Well, I can do my part here in my hometown by taking care of those who also serve. For Veterans Voices, I'm Amy Simpson. News Channel 34 will be broadcasting a half hour Veteran Voices special. It airs Saturday, November 9th at 7.30 p.m. on WBGH, and then again on Monday, November 11th, Veterans Day, at 5.30 p.m. on WBGH.